Lumen, one year later, what do I think now? So let me start this off by saying I really like the Lumen and I really enjoy all the benefits I've been able to take away from having it. And with that being said, I probably think it's a great option for just about everybody, right? Well, actually, I think this is probably not a good option for most people. I'll circle back to that. But first, after one year, let's break this thing down. First, in case you're new to the Lumen, what is it? Well, it's the tool that's known to help you hack your metabolism. And what it does is it uses a flow control and CO2 meter to use that to understand if you're burning carbs or fat for fuel. From there, it provides guidance to help make your ability to switch between burning fats and carbs more efficient, therefore making your weight loss or health journey easier and more successful because you can get away from being carb dependent. In short, it's a learning and training tool to help recalibrate your body for long-term health success. Ease of use. When you get this, are you gonna be able to jump right in and take advantage of it? Or are you gonna run into some problems? Well, there is a little bit of a learning curve. It's not a big deal, don't worry. But you have to learn how hard to start breathing into it when you start, how hard to breathe throughout the duration of the breathe out, how much to breathe in, and it guides you through all this, but it needs it to be in certain ranges so it can measure accurately. And at first, you don't really know what those amounts are. You kind of breathe into it too hard at the beginning and then kind of fall out of the range it wants, and it tells you to start over, and this can be a little frustrating. But after a very short while, you learn these tricks and you become an expert at it, and then you never run into it again just because you know Know what to do so small learning curve at the beginning not that big of a deal and then it's just smooth sailing after that so ease of use I'm gonna say is very high just a small learning curve accuracy for me I felt it's been pretty accurate now I do intermittent fasting so even if I had a bad meal the day before by the time I do a lumen reading in the morning it's been quite a while since I've had any calories and I burned up quite a bit of my carb stores and as a result I almost always get a two now if I was really bad the night before I might get a three and I have seen those I can also get ones they're rare but when I was really sticking to my diet really keeping my carbs low not cheating or having my intermittent fasting window go too late into the night I could earn a one I had to work for it and that was motivational and I could reach that but it was harder to get to I generally see a lot of twos but what I would get did seem to reflect my day so it did seem to be pretty accurate. And something I wish I'd done a little more is take readings throughout the day. I'm big on intermittent fasting, so I really wanna see myself starting today with a two or a one, and that reflects on my previous day. But also understanding what my meals are doing to me more in real time, you know, testing after meal or after a workout, you can take measurements throughout the day and better understand the immediate impact, and that can help teach you a lot about what you can do and the changes you can make with your diet and exercise and portions and all those different things. So there is more than just a morning reading, but as far as accuracy goes, it has seemed to be pretty darn accurate for me. Now, what would I like to see the Lumen improve on? Well, I mentioned that I start a lot of the days at a two, and this is great, it means I'm burning more fats than carbs, so I'm in a pretty good state. But is this the high side of two closer to a three, or the low side closer to a one? I have no idea. And that would be a huge difference, because if I'm closer to a one, that's where I wanna be. I'm starting off my day burning mostly fats, and I know my diet choices are working for me. But if it's close to that three, I'm not really burning that much more fat and I'm not really starting the day in the state I want. So a more granular view, maybe a zero to 100, where it really gets you accurate information and you know, hey, I'm really right where I wanna be or I'm at the high range of what used to be a two and I still have some work to do. I need to make some changes. I need to work harder on my diet or hold myself more accountable. But these are the things you'd be able to get out of that more granular information. So I would love to see that. And at its core, the Lumen is a learning tool that helps you understand the impact of your previous decisions. What is working for you and what's not. And to have a better reading, a more accurate reading that really gives you that granular information is gonna help you make such better decisions. So for me personally, if they did that improvement, it would just take it to the next level. So I'm hoping that's something we see over time. Regardless of my concerns with the granularity of the readout, the Lumen is still a very motivational and informational tool. 
I enjoy tweaking everything about my lifestyle to try to get the results that I want and learning from that. And that can be the things I've already mentioned, Porsche control, what you eat, how fast you eat, the type of exercise you're doing and how much exercise you get and even the quantity and quality of sleep you get. All of these can play a huge role in your metabolic flexibility. And the Lumen helps you understand the impacts of all these decisions. So it becomes very enjoyable to understand the impacts of these things and continue improving on these so you can put yourself in a state that best works for you because not everybody responds to the same changes the same. So it becomes kind of a game of sorts to see what you can get out of this, get the best numbers possible, and see the changes you want because of what you've been doing. And this isn't just what you wake up to. Let's say after a meal you might get a five and you just spiked your sugar really hard. Well, maybe you learn to make changes to that meal. You change how you built that same meal, whether it's Porsche control or removing a couple ingredients. And now suddenly after that same meal, you're only at a three or a four. You realize you've made drastic improvements that help you reach your health goals. And the Lumen is what helps you understand and realize these goals. So I'll admit, I mostly use the Lumen for the readouts you get from this thing, and then I go on my own and do what I want to do and make changes that I want to make in my diet. But inside the Lumen app, there is a wealth of information. So there are a lot of things, even things that might seem backwards. So for an example, let's say you've had a string of great days where you've had low readings. They might actually tell you to go have a high carb day to mix it up on your body and keep your metabolic flexibility high, which is important. They know some of these tricks you can do to put your body in a state where it can bounce between that burning of fat and carbs more efficiently and put yourself in a better state. So there are things they offer. They also have meal planning, history of all your readings, and a lot of different things that will just help you learn and make better decisions. So it's worth checking out. Honestly, I don't use it enough, but it's out there and you should look into it. So I mostly had good things to say about the Lumen. So why the heck would I start this video out by saying I don't think most people should get it? Well, I don't want to waste your money. The Lumen is a great tool, but it offers a rather specific service. And I think this is more of a final piece on your health journey than a just getting started. So if you're at this point where you're like, I need to take back my health, I don't think this is where I start. This is not the tool I go like, if I get this, I'm going to be able to reach all my health goals. This is the one thing I need. There are things that you need to do on your own first. Things that don't cost any money. Things that are just educating yourself and making better decisions. And so those things I already mentioned. Understanding your diet and making better decisions with how much you eat, the meals you choose, how you build out those meals and the ingredients that you use. Making sure that you hold yourself accountable and stop eating. Considering things like intermittent fasting. Making sure your hydration is high and that you get good sleep and that you're implementing a regular exercise routine. These are all the foundations for better health and weight loss if that's your goal. And once you've implemented all of those things, you've proved to yourself that you're going to do the things it takes to have your health journey go in the direction that you want. Lumen could be that tool that takes you to the next level. It could be that thing that says, okay, I've got my diet in a good place, but now let me learn what really works for me and what doesn't and how I can just get to that next stage in my health journey to make better decisions and know this does work for me, this doesn't, now I am more informed. So this is not a slam on Lumen at all. It's more about getting yourself right and proving to yourself that you're gonna put the work in that's needed. So that way, if you do get the Lumen, you can actually take advantage of it. So if you took anything away from this video, please hit that like button. Subscribe to know everything that's going on in this amazing health and technology world. And until next time, here's to a healthier you and have a good one.